Ford Focus RS is apparently the ultimate daily driver with some serious rally capabilities. Sadly, 98% of people that own these will never take them off-road and actually test their rally capabilities. But luckily for you guys, you know we don't care about breaking things on this channel, so we're gonna be the ones to go out and absolutely hoon the crap out of this on some backcountry dirt roads. I think I'm playing chess, I see a king, I met his neck. I'm three steps ahead of every move, now that's a check. Yes, they wanna know my secret, it's because I never slept. All my nightmares are me at 40, life's a wreck. See my all right guys, also, if you guys have not seen my own company that we are dropping, the graphic air fresheners are all now currently live. We have four different collections. We have an off-roading collection inspired by the Jeep. We have a car collection. We have a kind of country line here, which is a signature geez, signature collection I wanted to come out with just for some stuff, kind of the whole vibe back home. And then we have finally the power sports line that's all dirt bike and four-wheeler related. If you guys do want to go check these out, they are all link the website is in the bio or you can go to i'll put the link right here on the screen you guys can go there or click the link in the description to get them they're all three dollars a piece so the same exact price as a little tree you're not getting scammed on anything but you get a way cooler design they come in a bunch of different scents you can buy the whole collection individually or you can just buy five packs of one of the single designs you want but everything is live guys so make sure you head over to the site check those out when they're sold out they're sold out we only have about 30 of each design so and then that's it so thanks guys and uh, go check them out So it's proving to be a lot harder to find some dirt roads that we aren't going to get shot at by neighbors because like they're their private driveway. So that's what we're looking for right now. And then we're going to get into slinging this thing around some corners and seeing how it does. All right, guys, this is Caden. This is, what is your car? This is my 2017 Ford Focus RS. And today we're going to be hooning some absolute dirt roads and driving this like the RS is supposed to be yep. that no one actually does. So we're out here in some beautiful mountains ripping this. And uh, yeah, guys, hope you enjoy. I know how Jason feels filming for me. I'm getting peppered this time. Dude, oh my. That is the craziest shot you'll ever see. Dude. Definitely, definitely doing something. We're either gonna she be. She was like, "Damn, is that a focus R? <laughs> Dude, we're either gonna be on the like watch list for this neighborhood. Yeah. Like, who is this kid? Or she called the cops. We definitely just gotta get out of here. <laughs>
right, guys, what's up? So obviously we are no longer in New York, as you can tell by not the depressing gray clouds everywhere. Uh, but yeah, so finally made it out to Colorado. As you can see the Jeep, if you show the Jeep, made the terrible, terrible drive, but we wanted to show you guys kind of what the house is like and uh, what we're rocking with. First up, we got the garage here. This is Caden. You'll see Caden later, his car. He's got the Focus RS that you guys saw earlier in the video. Uh, and then just your normal garage, not too much done to it. We're still settling in, whatever. And then if we, we roll around into the house here. So pretty much pull up ping pong table because what else do you need in the house with a bunch of dudes? And then we got the kitchen in here. Pretty standard, like it's just the kitchen. I don't really know. Got living room with the best decor that like a bunch of teenage guys or whatever can come up with. This is like the best part of the whole place is when you go outside. Still a work in progress, don't worry. But then you have the deck and then you guys can see how many acres is it? I have no idea. No idea, okay. A lot. A good bit of acres for like normal out here. You have the crazy mountain views everywhere. Uh, pretty stinking insane for a spa out here. All right, so coming down here, we're not gonna go too in depth, but you got like your bathroom, no big deal. Normal bathroom. Then we have uh, Ronnie's room, which uh, Ronnie's on camera. All right, then we got, this is just my room. Just work in progress, got the desk and just a drill casually, but uh, that's pretty much everything inside. All right, so this is like the right half of the property. I don't know how many acres, apparently no one knows, but there's like, this is all graded off, like maybe do something with like a field or something cool here. And then all down there, there's just like a bunch of like different property. We're thinking like pit bike track or just doing some jumps and stuff for the dirt bikes and, and whatever with that. All right, and then again, work in progress. So we have a place set that we demolished and burned the other night for firewood. And then this is like the front lawn. You got the horse stables down there they're planning on doing some storage with. Uh, and there's like more lawn over that way. And just a beautiful, you know, look at that view. Can't, can't put a price on it. Actually you can, it's a lot, but. And then this is the last bit. If you show, there's like the whole lawn here, it comes all the way from the house. And then it goes all the way down there. Again, lots of room to work with, not entirely sure what well, everything's gonna happen here, but that's like the whole outdoor space. Uh, gotta get a bike still, gotta get some other things out here, like still moving everything in, but I uh, just wanna kinda show you guys this is the whole place. After about a month out in Colorado, I ended up flying home to film some really cool stuff for you guys back here in New York. And surprisingly, it has actually greened up here. The last time I left, it was totally snowing and disgusting when we filmed the Jeep video. And now it is absolutely gorgeous out and uh, spring is here. With our new summer temps, it's time to get the boat out because we want to take this thing up the lake. But it needs a ton of work until we can do that. So today we're going to make sure it runs and everything after sitting in storage here in the barn for the last eight months. First up is going to be getting the enormous deep cycle battery for the sound system and the cranking battery installed uh, to test the motor. Man, sometimes I even surprise myself with how good I am. I labeled everything last year, so all I got to do is hook these up now. Connect the grounds so we get our charging from our main motor on both. We should now have power, moment of truth. Looks like we got power. Let's see if she'll run. I told you, I knew it was gonna go off. And guys, my new upload schedule, we're gonna be doing weekly videos. So every Saturday at 9 a.m. EST, there'll be a new video dropping every single week. I'm gonna be trying my best, absolute bangers. Make sure you guys turn on post notifications. You're not gonna wanna miss what we have coming up and uh, get ready for weekly uploads. Oh my god! I told you. Stop! <laughs>
中にも全部。<笑>